Canadian Masters has just finished and your favorite tennis YouTuber was able to compete there. Not for very long and not very successful, but I was there and participated. And you know what it means? Yep, I got a player's gift as well. Player's gift was a common and handy thing before the pandemics. Some I'm still using till today. Like this backpack here. This one is from Doha ATP 250 and it reminds me about my great run out there. Some tournaments were given just little things like power banks, keychains, t-shirts. Others would go further and would give headphones, action cameras, watches or even the newest iPhones, believe it or not. In today's world, unfortunately, in most cases we get masks, hand sanitizers and soaps. All very important things, but... I just don't like it, huh? Anyway, let's get back to the Masters 1000 in Toronto and review their player's gift because I haven't received a proper one for a while now. Item number one, a laundry bag with my name on it. They spell it wrong and then correct it. Although I'm a famous tennis YouTuber, I'm still a pretty humble guy, you know. I'm not offended. And it was not very durable. Item number two, a plastic drinking bottle from Gatorade. It's probably a useful thing for some people, but in my case, it's staying in Canada. So far it's not really impressive, but my hope is not that yet. Third, some hair styling product from Revlon. Fourth, another hair product, this time from American Crew. Very good, I really need those to take care of that fancy haircut. Oh, now it's getting interesting, Lindt chocolate box. To be honest with you, Lindt is my favorite chocolate brand. But unfortunately, I have a lapse in memory, so I haven't seen that box since unpacking. Don't know what happened there. Item number 6. Popcorn. Chips. Another pack of chips. Hmm, that looks healthy. Oh, that's a good one. It's a foam roll, and you probably know how to use this already. But this is not just a regular roll you see every day. Let me show you one trick. It's a foldable foam roll. Want to unfold it? And that's it. It's ready to rock and roll. Can you believe it? Obviously not, because it's unbelievable. I won't be surprised if NASA has something to do with it. Really. I'm impressed. I've never seen anything like this. But I was even more impressed with the next one. Nintendo Switch, ladies and gentlemen, and a game Mario Tennis Aces to get you started. Yeah, it's just a Switch Lite, and it's obviously not the newest console out there. I was never a Nintendo fan myself. The hardware is terribly outdated. You can't even use your wireless headphones with this. Games are very expensive, and if you know how to watch movies on this thing while on a plane, let me know in the comments, because for now, I don't have an answer. I'm a PC and PlayStation gamer, there it has much more flexibility, and in terms of handhelds, I'm a proud owner of this portable PC, GPD Win 2, and I've already pre-ordered the Steam Deck. This is Steam Deck. So I never took Nintendo Switch seriously and would never buy one myself. But as this one is free, I gave it a try out of curiosity. And I was wrong. This thing is amazing, even with all its flaws. I think I was missing out all this time. Battery life is great, ergonomics are fine for handheld, it's worth it just for Nintendo exclusives alone. I've been playing it for hours every single day since I got it. Thank you Tennis Canada. And to all other tournaments out there, you see how good players' gifts can be? It might be a small thing for you, but it can make our day.